Hello guys. The next couple of weeks I'm going to try to photograph the Capricale. I think that's the right word. Capricale, big, black, beautiful bird. I've been trying to get this bird on uh, on camera for a couple of years. This year I'm at three new locations and uh, I'm going to make a, a series of the days that I'm out and how all this, how it is to uh, photograph wildlife. It's not always photos, it's not always perfect and it's not always you get what you want but sometimes it just all adds up. So follow this series and uh, hopefully you'll see a beautiful black, big black Capricale bird yourself. arrived uh, at the place we're going to be. I've been uh, scouting this location for <clears throat> a couple of weeks and uh, well I'm tracking I'm tracking bird shit so it's not really super sexy but to find uh, those big black birds you need to follow the bird shit. And right here, there's a lot. Look at this. See this? Everything here that looks a little bit like shit. You're absolutely right. It is. And that means that up. Mm -hmm. up there at night there's a bird I can't recall the name of the bird uh, I'll say that later hopefully you'll see it I will set up a tent back there and uh, back there and I will see if I can scout a location that makes this possible to get an insight here without being too close. I don't want to disturb the birds. Heading back to 
to It used to be home Passing by those little towns I know so well Stopping for gas And then I'm behind the wheel again Driving this like a spiritual cleanse Where every mile is a new beginning And every friend holds a new end Eyes on the road, don't lose control I'm speeding fast to chase my soul I'm driving to get away Running through emotions high and low Holding on or letting go I'm fighting another day Camp is uh, ready I just want you guys to see how it looks from the outside. Right there, this is just a few steps on the left side. It blends in really nice. The only thing that uh, sticks out is the lens. And uh, the tree that they're sitting up there in that area over here hopefully there will be around here inside the bushes and this is directly from the front I will be taking some branches in front of here and my dream shot is either up here here or around here so that is my goal for tomorrow the sun will hit from uh, the right side and I think this can be very nice I will uh, take some branches and uh, take it in front just need to be really careful that it doesn't fall down and so we'll see how it looks It help. Looks still a bit open down there. I'll take one more and uh, show that inside. out to see was the Capricel, big Capricel, or also called European Capricel. But uh, I didn't hear them settle down in the trees last night and there are no birds in the trees around me that I can hear. Some black grouse playing in the background. So I will take uh, I will take my camera down. I will get dressed and uh, see if I can s find some some black grouse. See how it goes. I. Uh, I found the grey goose, but when I saw them, I also did see that they were too far away to get in close, and I don't want to disturb their uh, mating rituals. It's important that uh, we leave nature at peace, and that we are only here to observe and not destroy anything
right now I'm going to the second location where I hear where I hear the grey goose. I only check it out because some other day I can come back, set up my hide a different place and uh, photograph them instead. The Capricorn didn't come, as I told her this morning, and uh, I hope it didn't get scared from my tent. I don't think it was that. I didn't hear them last night at all, so maybe they have uh, changed locations. I know they I will uh, walk around in the forest a little bit, see if I can find something cool, and uh, then I will head home. In a couple of days I will uh, head back out, but to a different location than this, to see if I can find uh, some other birds. Something. A woodpecker. It's not a big bird. It's a bird. I'm uh, back in camp. No big birds today. The only thing I found is a woodpecker. That's how it is. So I'll be packing down, heading home, and uh, I'm looking forward for the next uh, trip out. I'll probably make day one, day two, day three series of this one and just cut them short. So uh, day one is over. See you on day two.